Hey everybody, Dieter Bone here for PreCentral.net, and I want to show you the Palm Pre Virtual Keyboard developed by Eric Gaudet and everybody else at WebOS Internals and available via the uh, Preware application here. Now our full post is going to have instructions on how to install Preware because it's, uh, it takes a couple of steps. It's not quite as simple as File Coaster, which is what most of you have used, but uh, once you've got it up here, you load it up and you go into the Available Patches section and you will see there is a virtual keyboard patch and so you just tap that it's going to uh, look like your pre is restarting but it's actually just restarting the the graphical user interface which is called luna um, and then uh, once you've got that going you can uh, just have any screen with a cursor on it basically anywhere you can enter text that is active and you double tap on the gesture area and whoa, hey there is the keyboard and you can see you can type and the uh, buttons pop up over your finger and you can you know, slide your finger around and hit enter and once it's done your keyboard will go away and there you go you just saw us enter text it works pretty well all right well we'll, uh, we'll launch memos and uh, show it to you in action yet again um, the keyboard does, you know, work just like an on-screen keyboard. It, uh, it can do caps, but I can't get the symbols to work, and I don't know exactly what that is. So double tap the gesture area, and uh, up it pops. And you can double tap it again to toggle it. And uh, you can just type, and you can see, yeah, symbol's not working there yet for me. But uh, it does uh, pop up the letter as you tap on it, so you can see what you're tapping on. doesn't do fancy autocorrection, um, and just a little bit buggy. You want to be very sure that you use um, WebOS uh, internals to install Preware to install this, and I've got the full instructions up at PreCentral. And you also want to be very sure that you want to uninstall the uh, the patch that turns this keyboard on before you apply any WebOS update because uh, it's a patch, and so it could potentially uh, break stuff if you uh, update WebOS from uh, an update from Palm without getting rid of it. Um, but that said, it works passably well, and uh, presumably that will uh, only get better over time. There you go, the virtual keyboard on the Palm Pre.